Usually, sinaserve ito pag ano eh. May mga fiesta. Doon mo makikita talaga. Magsaserve yung mga pamilya ng mga lengua. Lengua estofada. Cooked in uh, tomato sauce or cooked in cream. Hello, I'm Richard Gomez and welcome to Goma at Home. For today's uh, recipe, we are preparing lengua estofado. How do you say that? Lengua estofado? Lengua estofada. Pag lalaki, estofado. Pag babae, estofada. Okay, and we're cooking it with uh, Doña Elena. Extra virgin olive oil. You know, in lengua, you know, medyo matigas to. That's why you have to pressure cook it. But once you cook this properly, napakalambot nito. So what we'll do is, we'll cook this in our Instapot. Okay, we'll cook this for about uh, 45 minutes. Pag kumuha kayo sa, sa market, make sure na malinis na siya. Ayan, tanggalin natin yung uh, dumikit ng mga tissue paper. Ayan. Huwag matas yun ang fat sa collagen content nito. No? So we'll put this here. And then, we'll cut, we'll cut some uh, onions. We'll put it there. Pwede hindi nyo natanggalin yung ano. Pwede hindi nyo natanggalin yung, yung skin ng onions. And just uh, cook it there, ganyan. And then just drop it there. Good. And then some, some garlic. No? And then, gumitin lang naman natin yung ano nun. Yun para pampalambot ng, pampalambot ng ano natin, ng, uh, ng lengua natin. We'll put it there. We'll put some uh, ginger. The menu na kasi para lahat ng smell at saka yung lansa ng nandila ma matanggal na ma-neutralize natin. Okay? So, ayan mo na ng black pepper and soy sauce. There you go. Good. Very good. Some salt. Pagyan na marami salt, doesn't matter. Good. Put in some bay leaves. Okay. Put lots of bay leaves. Ayan. Bay leaves talaga pang ano, pang aroma. Nakagyan natin ng soy sauce. Okay. Good. It's a good amount of soy sauce. Para pumasok na rin yung half a cup, para pumasok na rin yung lasa dun sa, no, sa, sa lengua. Alright, and then, nagyan ng tubig. That's it. Okay, there you go. And then we'll close it. There, and then, close. So what we'll do is we'll uh, pressure cook it to 45 minutes and then uh, pressure level, low pressure, high pressure, mag high pressure tayo. So high pressure and uh, 45 minutes, that should go now. Okay, on, ready. Okay, so at this point naman, we will peel our potatoes and ilalagyan natin sa bowl. And habang nilalagyan ni, ni runs ng water yung bowl natin, ipipil ko na itong potatoes natin. And, and then, what we'll do is we'll we'll, we'll fry the we'll fry our potatoes. No, ito ang natin na style naman today. We can cut this into let's see, kung malaka siya, ganon, into quarters. Pwede pa haba, no? That kind of cut, medyo pa haba, good. So that's how we'll uh, cut our potatoes for today. Pasang pang fries, parang pang fries. That's how we'll do it, okay? Ang ganda kasi ng pag-peel mo na, ano, ng potatoes, very thin yung skin niya. So, hindi mo kailangan, ano, hindi mo kailangan bigyan ng masyadong pressure. Okay? Then, pag medyo maliit siya, laki mo na yung putol. Potter cook evenly. Tapos, pag may nakita kang dark spot dun sa, ano, sa potato, like this, Tanggalin mo na yan. Bad na yan. So, take it out. Pull. Yan. Yan lang iiwan mo. Good? Alright. Ito, masarap to talaga. Paano? Usually, sinaserve to pag ano eh. May mga, mga fiesta. Doon mo may kita talaga. Magsaserve yung mga pamilya ng mga lengua. Lengua estofada. Cooked in um, tomato sauce or cooked in cream. No? 
may choice kayo but basically the same lang yan ang naiba lang is the base as either cream or tomato okay so that's it and then one more one more okay tanggalin ko lang to I'll clean this up pwede nyo gamitin to fertilize i-compost nyo lang that's it so I'll take out the tissue paper put it in the trash can para itong mga mga peel no mga peelings magamit natin okay for compost the next time I'll show you kung pa paano namin kinocompost yung ganito mga materials namin alright I'll hit up my skillet I'll hit up my pot kasi pot ang gagamitin natin for this and then we'll fry it ginaganong ko lang siya binabat ko lang siya dun sa ano binabat ko siya sa tubig para hindi lang siya mangitim so now i-drain na natin siya and then ready to for frying tapon ko lang yung tubig okay just like that tapos initin natin yung pot natin you can use uh, extra virgin olive oil of course to fry your, your potatoes but don't heat it up too much ang gusto mo lang naman sa potatoes is not to fully cook it what you want is to half it half cook it and then brown it lang so yan konti lang yung uh, olive oil na kailangan natin for that pag uminit na yan, babagsak na natin yung potatoes and then ihanguin na natin and then while we're doing that i-prepare ko na rin yung, yung onions natin no, ito na yung gamitin natin for, for our saute so by the time na matapos yung lengua natin tapos na rin yung saute natin so mabilis yung mabilis yung uh, pagluto ng, ng lengua kasi normally pag hindi ka gumamit ng, ano, ng pressure cooker it will take you at least mga <laughs> good 3 hours to boil the lengua kasi nga medyo tough yung yung meat niya good eh uh, this one kapal yun gamit ang dalawang onions bakit marami no pag gumagal nagpuputol ng onions umiiyak no naluluha ha ano uh, bakit daw kasi nga bakit naluluha pag nagpuputol ng onions under sa misis no ganon Ano ba yun? Ha? Hindi. Kaya kaya naluluha because blunt niya, no? Blunt yung, yung knife. If you need, if you have a sharp knife, hindi siya magsispray yung yung juice ng ano? Yung juice ng uh, onions. Uh, so, this rough chop lang. Yan lang. So, we're done with our onions. Ngayon, medyo mainit na yung oil natin. Aha! Uh -huh. And, lagyan natin yung potatoes. Good! Woohoo! Yan talaga yan. Matalsik yan kasi nga, galing yan sa tubig. So, let it stay there for a while. And then, habang binabrown natin yung potatoes natin, gawin na natin yung iba natin ingredients. No? Like, garlic. One head of garlic is uh, good enough for, for, for me today. Good. Yun. Yun na. Ano lang, no? Hmm? Okay. Good. Pag malakas yung tilamsik niya, huwag yun ang buong nabuksan niya, no? Yung cover na, no? Ng uh, pot ninyo. Instead, hawakan siya ng ganito. Yan. Tag Diyan siya i- Diyan siya i- 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 mix. Yan. Good. Let it stay. Kapag ginagawa natin yan, tatapusin naman natin itong garlic natin. Tanggalin lang natin yung skin niya. And then we'll mince it. Tutuloy natin siya ng uh, maliit. You know, if you do this together, no? Beta na matapos itong lengua, you peel off the, the skin of uh, the tongue. And then, nakasote ka na lahat. So take another 15 to 20 minutes. Then, ready ka na agad mag-serve ng food. Bilis lang. So, to save time, kailangan 
ginagawa mo na lahat. So after our potatoes, gagawin na natin yung sauce natin, yung, uh, yung tomato sauce. We'll use two cans of, uh, again, Don Elena, uh, whole peeled tomatoes. And then gamit tayo ng mushroom. So with the mushroom, tanggalin ko lang yung, yung brine niya. Tapon na natin yung brine niya. Okay, good. Let's just wash my hands na rin. Okay, sige, humawa ko ng garlic. Pag humawa ko ng garlic, medyo malagkit. Mushrooms. Okay. It's up to you, pwede nyo pang dagdagan. So, gagawin ko, in my case, dadagdagan ko pa ng mushroom. May pang mushroom. No? Good eh. Woohoo! Mahinit ang laban. Mahinit ang laban. Nice. Binabrown ko lang talaga itong ano, itong puti ko itong actually just to give it lang more color. Yan. So, in 2-3 minutes, I'm done with that. Okay? I'm good. Babalik ko lang siya dito. Yun. Okay. Ito na. That's it. And then, hinaan ko lang yung yung fire natin dito. I'll just put it on the side. And then, we'll uh, put in our put in our onions no? sa mainit natin na ano na na oil bagsak good eh. nice yeah. gawin natin spicy to tap to pag spicy eh. we'll put in some uh, chili no chili tapos yung paprika will add uh, more paprika powder okay so, pag translucent na yung onions natin, we can drop in our garlic and then we'll drop in our our peeled uh, tomatoes. Let's just wash it up. Although, alam ko na hinugasan ito, but then just showing the people na kailangan. When you open canned goods like this, dapat talaga hinugasan. Okay. Good. Goody. Kaya ko lang yung garlic and we'll put in our tomatoes salt and pepper good let's mix this tomatoes and then mamaya hugasan natin ano i-rinse natin yung, uh, yung tomatoes natin para magamit yung remaining sauce niya sa loob. Let's get some water. No? Yan lang. Tapos, haluin niyo siya na, no? Kutsara. Para hindi sayang yung mga iwan na tomatoes niya sa loob. Good. Ini so, oh, betul. Ini lagi nolang. And then, kita nak kugasan, bagsamat ni tu. Nice. Oh, jin tatapun yang kucara, sayang yang kucara. Isave yang kucara nya. And then, let's. Cut some uh, bell pepper. Yun. Hmm? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. So just cut into strips, big strips like this. And yeah. there you go. Just like that. Mushrooms natin, we'll 
cut it in half. Kasi malaki siya eh. Mm. Very easy like that. Mm. Ganda na ng boil ng tomatoes natin. Beauty. Beautiful. Beautiful. See that? Then, we can already add our pimiento. That's it. Let's put in our mushrooms also. Saman nyo na dyan yun. Good. And then, we'll uh, add in our additional flavors. Put in some uh, onions and uh, salt. Nilalagyan din natin ng paprika. There you go. Black pepper. Dami natin. Dalawang lengua yung niluto natin dyan. Eh. Okay. Nice. That's it. Bring it there. That's your pepper. We put in our salt. Okay. Tapos pag kulang pa yung salt mamaya, just add na lang to taste, no? And then may, may bay leaves tayo. Lagyan natin ng bay leaves. Good. We put in our paprika. Yung olives, we can put it later na. Sasabay na natin sa natin. Sasabay na natin dun sa, sa lengua. Beautiful. Itong paprika to, it enriches the taste of uh, the sauce. Very earthy in flavor to. So, paprika comes from capsicum, pepper. Ito naman yung powdered form niya. Hitin lang natin na mawala yung pressure niya. And then, paglamig ng konti na ano, ng uh, lengua, ready to peel it and then ready to cook. There you go. So, na lumamig na. Malamig na yung, yung lengua natin. No? All you have to do is just open it up. Cut it on top. Well, manipis lang. Ganun lang. Oh. And then, open yun yun. No? Peel it off. Yun. You know, when I, when I first uh, cooked itong lengua, nakalimutan ko na kailangan palang ipil yung ano, kailangan palang ipil yung, yung balat. Sabi ng, sabi ng friend ko, bago mo ano, bago mo lutuin talaga yung putulin, dapat tinatanggal mo yung ano, yung, yung, yung balat. I didn't know na kailangan palang tanggalin yung, ay, kailangan palang tanggalin yung ano, yung outer skin. So, yan, i-discard nyo lang, itatapon nyo lang. Pwede nyo rin gabitin pang compost. No? Okay? So, have two pieces. Ginamit natin, niluto natin today. Tatabi ko na to. I'll wash my hands again. I'm ready to slice my lengua. What I'll do lang, I'll just clean lang yung nasa gilid. No? Yan. Actually, it's still good, but I don't want it ng dark. No? So, tatanggalin ko na siya. You can leave it there. Gusto ko lang na appetizing lang siyang tignan, kaya ako tinatanggal. Ayan. Good. Ang bango na ng sauce natin, no? Oh, I mean, I'm gonna go Wow, ready. Mm -hmm. Nice. Goody. That will be our sauce. Para sa, sa lego natin. Okay. That one is actually done. Dito na tayo. Puputulin natin yung lego natin. Okay, so, medyo kapala natin ng konti. Yun. Kasi malambot na siya. And ayaw mo naman na pag niluto mo, siya, mo pa siya, madudurog na. So you want it na medyo makapal. Pag na ano siya, pag uh, binoil mo na siya, 
Tapos tama yung tama yung recado mo. You can really smell it. It's so good. It smells so appetizing. Yeah. Okay. So everything's been prepared. Cut up na siya. And then, what we'll do now, ililipat na natin tong uh, sauce natin to a bigger pot. And then may may iwan dun sigurado nakadikit sa ilalim. And we will deglaze it. Okay? Slowly, we'll put it here. So, kung walang ano, kung walang naiwan na, na browning doon, what you can do, just heat it up a little. And then, yung broth na pinaglutuan ng, ano, ng uh, lengua, just go through it there. Yun lang, oh, ganun lang. Konti, kahit konti lang. And then, kunin mo na lahat ng mga naiwan na ano na sauce dito. So, niluto natin ng tomato kanina. Yan. You get all the all the flavor of your food. No? No? Put it at uh, low heat. Good. And then, again, onto the jam. Turn it off. And then, additional uh, na broth natin. Stand by lang to. So, Pag medyo nag-dry siya ng konti, you can always put in your additional broth dun sa sauce para sa estafada. Alright. So at this point, what I'll do is, I want to try it now. So, tapusin ko na yung sauce ko. Remember in cooking, when cooking with sauce, talagaan mo talaga yung sauce na masarap yung, masarap yung lasa ng sauce. Kasi nandun talaga yung, yung secret, yung may cooking mo I'll just put in, okay, put in a little more salt. Good. And then, I want it a little spicy, di ba yung sinabi ko kanina? Nagawin natin spicy yung, yung ano natin, yung lengua. Put in a chili. Open it up. Just like that. So, sa ganyang kalaki, put in lagi mo ng dalawa na naka-open. May dating na yan. Okay. And then, add one more bay leaf. Bay leaf. And some green olives. Nice. Good. That's it. Okay. And then, yung Yung lengua natin, ilalagyan na natin dito. Haluin ko lang ng konti. Let me mix it. Taas ko lang ng konti yung fire. And then, ilagyan na natin yung, yung lengua natin. Ayusin nyo na. Yan lang ganyan. That's it. Hmm? So, lalagay ko na yung additional broth yung pinaglutuan ng, uh, ng lengua kanina. There you go. And then, we let it simmer. Ah, nice. I'll give it about 20 minutes. Let it simmer for 20 minutes. And then, babalikan natin to. And if it's good, we'll serve. Okay? Sama ko na yung potatoes natin dito on top. Yeah. In 15 to 20 minutes, we're ready to serve. Okay, let's check on the lengua. Wow! Bango! Ah! Bango! Sarap! Talagang pang fiesta yung, ano, yung dating niya. No? Pang fiesta talaga to. Okay. One more try. And then, uh, sila natin kung balambot na ba talaga yung lengua natin. 
sa ayon siya na serve na para sa goma so kata detal na sa side para makita mo malambot and then try okay with my favorite drink buko hmm hmm Humahabol yung ano, yung anghang ng, ng lengua. Sarap. Sauce is good. Ito na yung potatoes natin. Fantastic ha. Ah. Okay. Sarap. Maanghang. Lengua natin, ayusin natin. Nice. Good. There you go, in it. Okay. Using it down. Let's make it look beautiful. And here is our lengua stafada with Doña Elena extra virgin olive oil. And uh, let's put some uh, Doña Elena extra virgin olive oil. Okay. Okay. Let's try this. Wow. Succulent, potatoes are good. Sakto yung luto ng patatas. Yung sauce is thick. The lengua is soft. Mm. Up. Mm. And with the Doña Elena, extra virgin olive oil. Ito enhancing yung taste ng, ng lengua stofada. Really good. Sarap, mainit lang. Mm. Mm. Good. Wow. Potato. Mushroom. That was really good. Lengua Stofada. So there's your Lengua Stofada. Thank you so much for joining me right here in Gomatum. Please like, share, subscribe, and press on the notification bell para alam niyo kapag mayroon tayong bagong video na palabas. Okay? So this one's really good. Ang sarap. Just always remember, prepare it ahead of time. No? Yung mga ingredients niya para in order yung pagluto niya. Okay? So please do this in your own kitchen. Share it with your friends and enjoy it with your family. I'll see you again next time right here in Gomat Home. Goodbye.